Another thing which, uh, whenever I've listened to you talk, um, uh, that's really struck me, is your ability to articulate um, your lean methodology. And so, can I uh, give you an opening to um, describe the China Accelerator approach to helping those Western uh, entrepreneurs um, adapt very, very quickly to the Chinese market? Sure. Well, we don't uh, pretend to have all the answers. Uh, actually, we almost never tell people what to do. Sure. Um, so lean, um, you know, is uh, you read the book, um, but uh, what we recommend is is actually you know doing it. Uh, and uh, so there's a uh, there's a, there's a big difference between doing something and reading about it. In a sure, book. sure. Yeah. Uh, so uh, um, so I, I got a lot more from lean startup machine. Uh, than I did from uh, the book Lean Startup. Uh, and uh, the, the founders of Lean Startup Machine actually work out of our office in Shanghai here at China Accelerator. Uh, mm -hmm. So that's good. Uh, they actually run a pre-accelerator program, uh, Lean Venture Partners, in, in partnership with us. And it's good to have them like in-house. Mm -hmm. um, but uh, so our approach is uh, experiments. Um, so ideas are like uh, noses, you know, everybody has one. Um, the biggest difference between, um, you know, an idea and a success is ex execution. Um, so what we do is we take those assumptions and we, we try them out. Um, and it's much better to, uh, to test, out, test somebody whether something works and then build it rather than build it and then test whether something works. And this is basic lean methodology. There's, it's not rocket science, mm -hmm. um, but we implement it in a pretty aggressive way. We try and get our companies that we work with to do at least three to five experiments a week. Uh, a typical experiment can take as little as four, maybe eight hours, sometimes 10 hours to set up. Uh, so um, we try not to burn out the people too badly here. That's why we have a, a, a community. Uh, we're all kind of working in the same space, uh, trying to support each other. Uh, and that, that really helps. And, and uh, for us who've been through it uh, many times before, we try and support the entrepreneurs that we work with. We do small batches, you know, eight, 10, 12 companies per batch. Uh, so everybody knows each other quite well. Uh, and it's this sort of process. Uh, so um, uh, experiment, 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 test the assumptions uh, and, and think about it uh, like a conversation. Um, so if you're selling something in Australia or the US, you can go talk to your customers, uh, but when you don't speak the same language as they do, um, you're talking to them through your product or through your service. So you show them something new, and then um, and then they, they use it or they don't use it. They click the button or they don't click the button, and they're talking back to you through your product. Uh, and then uh, you listen to them, and then you uh, change the product a bit, and then you send it back. Uh, and each time you send them a new product and they and they play with the product, that's a conversation. If you're only updating your product and only sending a new product like once a month and then they're responding once a month, that's a very slow conversation. Uh, so what we try and do is we try to accelerate that to doing a continuous uh, experimentation, trying to be pretty disciplined about, you know, this is my assumption, this is what we're gonna try out, uh, this is what our expectation of the results gonna be, okay, this is what we ended up with, um, there's full transparency and reporting, you know, things fail all the time. That's the, the whole point. Um, but the point is um, not just to fail, but to, you know, to fail faster so you can get to the success faster. And we have, um, you know, with startup, right? So about a third of our companies die, uh, but uh, uh, about two thirds, you know, a third do quite well and a third uh, are, are, are hanging in there and doing pretty well. Uh, we tend to invest in uh, cockroaches. Uh, so the problem with uh, continually failing uh, is that uh, it can kind of drag on you. So cockroach is uh, someone that gets stepped on, uh, but uh, gets up and keeps on going. Uh, so we have a lot of companies that a year, year and a half, two years later, uh, <laughs> one of their experiments finally, uh, or a series of experiments finally uh, took off. Uh, and uh, they're seeing that sort of hockey stick that everybody always talks about. Right. And 